Hey guys, it's Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video. So I know I've been gone for a while, but I hope I can redeem myself by showing you a really cool way to create material design websites literally in seconds. So um, if you, unless you've been living in a cave, you'll note that material design is basically everywhere and that Google have really invested their time and effort into creating palettes, design templates, everything, color templates, um, well, that's actually a palette, but icons, everything basically. Um, and they're, they're, I think they're even going to create, well, you can see here in the new version of YouTube, you can see a little bit material design. So material design is especially popular in Google apps and not only Google apps, like even Expedia apps or really a lot of apps have material design. So it's a trend right now. So I'm going to show you how you can create a really cool material design in seconds. So um, you're going to head over to materialicss.com and let's click get started. By the way, I want you guys, if you can, to donate to them. They're really cool um, guys. I really follow them. I've even donated. Um, and I'm going to show you how it e easy it is to create, you know, um, a, a mature design website. All right. So, um, oops, my cat just stepped on my laptop. So, to include it, we're going to use CDN. You can also use NPM or Bower, I think. Yeah, Bower. But CDN is basically a content delivery network where you just copy a code and you automatically include it. So this is our CSS. And this is our JavaScript that we need to include. All right. All right. Now, nothing has happened, but let me show you how easy it is. For example, if you want to add um, a nav bar. So I'm gonna click, I'm gonna copy this one because I think it's really cool. Um, and we're basically just going to paste it. There we go. So it's really that simple. We have a working nav bar. And if we want to change the color, you can add here nav class equals nav extended. You can add teal and it's teal. You want to add blue, blue. You want to add yellow, yellow. Add all the, I don't think it looks that good. And let me see what red if it's available. Orange. I mean, you kind of get it, right? And let me just try black because I'm really curious. Yeah, all right. I think my favorite is blue. All right, so it's really that simple, but now we can also go ahead and add, let's say, a forum. Let's add this forum here. So I'm just copying and pasting right now. There we go. Well, I mean, it's not really positioned well, but you can put it inside like a div with um, max width of like 800 pixels or whatever. Um, but there, there's pretty much everything you want here. Uh, let's copy this, for example. I'm going to copy paste it a couple of times. There we go. Oh, well, the image is not loading. But we have cards here, um, although the image is not loading. Now I'm going to insert a footer. Hmm. It's this right here. I'm going to paste it right here. There we go. Um, and I'm also going to add color blue. Blue. And then to these cards. Let me just... Uh... Well, can I add color like a class blue? Can I add blue to this? Yeah. So I'm going to add blue. No, actually, let's add a yellow. Yellow. Um, yellow. I'm trying to keep this tutorial very short. Uh, although I am literally wasting time with changing colors yellow and then one more yellow, 
yellow. All right. Well, so it's been exactly uh, 40 seconds probably. And we have a working material design website. Obviously, it doesn't do anything, but this just proves how easy it is to. Oh, what happened here? To. Oh, I think because I put the. Yeah, yeah, okay. I put a card title by accident. Um, but there are literally preloaders, pagination, everything you want is here. So, that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you did find this tutorial helpful, please make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, donate to the Materialize CSS team. They're, you, you see how much effort they've put in this. It's really simple to create a website. But yeah, so I'll see you in the next one. Peace.